Subunit 2.5, Teamwork Summary. Teamwork has been critical for the success in the engineering work world. Uh, multidisciplinary teams are responsible for the development of systems, and you need to need be able to understand how to work in a multidisciplinary team. And the principles that lead to successful teamwork um, include understanding those interactions between team members. And we provided an overview of the Myers-Briggs type indicator. For the young engineers working on a team for the first time, listen and learn. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Uh, you won't be the first one to make a mistake, and you may, only, you may be the first one to admit it, but you're certainly not the first one to make it. And uh, just follow some of your more experienced seasoned systems engineers. Watch what they do. Watch how they act. Watch how they interact with people. They've, uh, they do that because they've learned over the years some of the tricks of this trade, and uh, that would be my advice. Do I have advice for young scientists working on a team for the first time? I think, um, number one, it can be of great pleasure. And so anticipate that working on a team for a shared goal uh, that's worth pursuing can be absolutely inspiring. Um, but number two, uh, recognize that even if they're counting on you to be a lead scientist, nevertheless, um, you don't know everything. And there are people around you who can solve every problem better than you can. And so don't think because you're a scientist that you're better. You're different not better. So um, I think it's really important to approach teams uh, as, as equal partners as much as possible at the same time as recognizing what your job is, which is sometimes to make decisions or make a particular scientific call uh, and people wait for you to do this. So uh, sort of have to sense where your job is and, uh, and act accordingly. Um, none of us are good at everything. Congratulations, you've made it to the end of Unit 2, Teamwork you can now take the Unit 2 quiz. Remember that this quiz counts for 10% of your grades, so study hard and good luck. If you're choosing to participate in the Mars Sample Return Project, please click the icon for that page as well. This week's assignment will be to begin your research.